The future is fresh. I'm Matt, co-founder of Afresh. We build supply chain software that is specialized for all of the nuances of fresh food. And when I talk about fresh, I'm talking about the things you find on the perimeter of the grocery store. Produce, meat, deli, bakery, prepared foods. It's what consumers want in the trillion dollar US grocery industry. It's where all the growth is occurring. And from a strategic perspective, it really differentiates a brick and mortar real world grocer from the online competition. At the same time though, in working with these grocers, I came to see that all of the technology in this industry was built for the non-fresh food first. And as a result, it would break down when faced with the inherent complexity of fresh food, be it perishability, short shelf life, different tastes, uh, not having a barcode, being sold by weight. These things would break down the technology, and the result is, is that grocers would have to resort to human intuition and manual processes to make the most critical decisions in their stores. That, in turn, causes tens of billions of dollars of food waste, and on the flip side, uh, tens of billions of dollars of stockouts and lost sales, not to mention less fresh food. So the simple thesis we had was, the future is fresh, yet all of the technology is built for the non-fresh food. So if we could build the first fresh food first supply chain software company built using the cutting edge of technology, we might be able to massively reduce food waste and multiply the profits of grocers. So I had the opportunity to go to Stanford to test that thesis. That's where I met my co-founders. Nathan is our COO. He has a deep technical background as a former robotics engineer. And Vladimir is our CTO. He has a PhD in computer science and machine learning from Stanford. And is at the absolute cutting edge of artificial intelligence. We came together and built our first tool. It's a store level replenishment tool that helps grocers place a profit maximizing, waste minimizing order for every fresh item in their store. We partnered with the grocer and found that this is the kind of effectiveness they can have. This is watermelon sales, and you can see a highly erratic demand curve that our demand forecasting absolutely nails. We partnered with the regional grocer and found that it cut their food waste in half, and in doing so, nearly doubled the profitability of their stores, adding two to $300,000 in profit per store per year. So with that, we were super excited. We formed a company around it. We raised our seed round in January, a couple million dollars from VCs, and since then, I've closed additional grocery partnerships with grocers totaling 500 stores and about $10 billion in revenue across them, ranging from pilots to full chain-wide deployments. Our business model is a SaaS model in which we lock in the value we, we create for these grocers and then take just a percentage of that as our revenue. We think Fresh is widely underpenetrated by technology. We're starting at the store level, but we're gonna roll our solutions up to the warehouse and distribution center level and ultimately up to suppliers as well. We're here at Food Bites because we're looking for really passionate, talented people to join us on our mission to reduce food waste. And also we've received a lot of interest from investors for our Series A, so we're hoping to talk to food and ag and, uh, and impact investors as well. Thank you.